Now that we have we have understood what electric field is, there should be something in the space that should indicate that there is an electric field there. Okay. For example, if I have if I have a source charge Q, then in this space it does not seem that there is an electric field. Okay. So what do we do is to draw a line, a vector that represents an electric field. Now for a point charge, we know that electric field is given by, by 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught into Q upon R square into R cap. Okay. Now, if this is the point, say, 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 I want the field here, and an R cap is an outward normal always. When Q is positive, this will remain an outward normal. When Q is negative, it will flip due to the scalar multiplication by a negative number, right? So, so here depending on the value of this and the value of this which is a constant and this i'll have a vector now let us say let us say let us say that q is let q be a positive charge be a positive charge I'll, I'll, I'll draw here. So this is Q. At this distance, there will be some length of the vector. Okay. Let us say this this. Okay. Now at the same length here, though the direction is different, the magnitude of the vector is the same. So it should be something like this. Okay. At this distance, at this point, it is it is this the outward normal, right? The length will remain the same. Why? Because the magnitude remains the same. Why? Because R remains the same. Okay, so 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 same with with this. The same distance I am drawing here. So it will be something like this. Right? Here. It will be something like this. Here. It will be something like this. Here. Okay. Now, if I want the field here, then this electric field electric field can be represented by another vector. Now this vector, this vector will be smaller than this. Why? Because R has become higher and hence the magnitude of this electric field has gone down. So maybe it reduces to this. And at the same distance from, from, from the center, this becomes this. And here it becomes this. And here it becomes this. Similarly, 
same distance, same magnitude. Now we move ahead. So say here. Here the vector will become smaller. Same with this. Equidistant. Same here. Same here. Same here. Same here, right? If I move ahead, maybe smaller still, smaller still, smaller still, smaller still, but equal in length because, because these vectors are equidistant. At this point, I'd also like to highlight that that it is not that the field lies in this very plane. We are drawing here because we are able to draw in this plane only. So, so there will be a field here also, right? So, there will be a field here also, there will be a field here also, here also, here also, right? So, it has a, it has a spherical symmetry. It is in the 3D. Let us, let us not forget that, okay? Now we see drawing this kind of a structure can become a tedious job, correct? Also, also one more thing to be highlighted is, it is not that the field is not present here, it is also present here, it is also present here, then it is also present here, also present here, okay? It is present everywhere, but the trouble is, if I draw it everywhere, then it will become all arrows, all black arrows, and still there will be some space between two arrows. So, so, so we do not draw it at all the places, because it is a representative thing. It only represents that there is a field. We intuitively know that there will be a field here as well. Fine. And drawing say 50 vectors for, for representing the, the electric field of one charge will become very tedious, right? It becomes very tedious. So, so what we do is, what we do is, we draw it like that. But even drawing it like this, in the, in the way I have drawn it, it is, it is, it is about 32 vectors that I have drawn. It is. 32 vectors I have drawn, okay? So what was thought of is this. What happens, what happens if instead of drawing like this, drawing like this, I connect these vectors and draw a straight line. draw straight line and do not draw the vectors If I draw a vector like this, it does not matter where I put these arrows. So say I draw a vector like this for the charge Q. I, I draw these lines. Now immediately, the moment we compare these two, immediately one thing becomes clear that the information about the length of these vectors has been lost. It has been lost. Because now I cannot make out which vector is what and what is the length of these vectors, isn't it? So here I, I can very well see that this magnitude at this point 
is this and and at this point is this and this point is this and if i set a scale if i set a scale say say i say 1 cm is equal to 10 newton per coulomb then just by measuring these vectors i'll be able to tell their magnitude now what do i do here there is no start no end of any vector right it has become a continuous line i have i have filled the gaps and made it a line so so what happens to the information about the magnitude what happens to the magnitude the direction another thing the direction the sense of direction here remains intact so so if we connect the vectors together it becomes a line it becomes a line and it seems and it seems that the information about the magnitude of the vector magnitude of the sorry electric field which was the magnitude which was represented by the length of the vector gets lost it gets lost the 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 information about the length of the vectors gets lost right now now fine so what has happened this is easy to draw than this but somehow i have lost an information or so it seems that we have lost an information now what happens the ease of drawing does not mean that i should have lost an information that is not acceptable at any cost that is not acceptable fine but then there is another thing has that information actually been lost or can i reconstruct it from something that i see here now if we if we look at it more closely we see that the 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 places where the electric field is higher is the places is the place near the charge near the charge as we go farther away the magnitude of the field goes down now is there some characteristic in this electric line which is peculiar about 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 it when it is near the charge is there something peculiar about it the answer is yes what is peculiar about it i find out that near the charge that near the charge what happens the electric field lines are closer together fine and away from the charge they are farther apart fine so at the places where my magnitude is higher okay the region where 
द मैग्नीट्यूड ऑफ द फील्ड इज हायर द मैग्नीट्यूड ऑफ द फील्ड इज हायर द इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड लाइन्स आर क्लोजर टूगेदर करेक्ट इट इज क्लोजर टूगेदर एंड द प्लेस इज वेयर द रीजन वेयर द मैग्नीट्यूड ऑफ द फील्ड इज is smaller the electric field lines are farther apart see now i can i can code this information i can i can use this information to somehow convey the magnitude of the field okay i can use this information to convey the magnitude of the field so so i'll have to plan something because magnitude is something that is an exact quantity so i can i can say so to represent the magnitude the the nearness of the lines the nearness of the lines has to be converted into the magnitude okay so what do we do we say we we say in in 1 meter square area okay so this is a charge it has got a 3d orientation so there are electric field lines moving everywhere and i take 1 meter square area at at a particular distance and i say at this distance if so many lines pass through this area then it represents such and such magnitude we understand so the number of lines therefore the number of electric field lines per unit area represents the magnitude of the electric field okay the number of electric field lines per unit area so what happens as i am closer together these lines are more crowded so i can i, I can put a scale kind of thing fine so i say maybe for example i say 20 lines per meter square is equal to say 20 newton per coulomb okay 